everybody and welcome back to another episode of Bella Gato Tours. I'm Desi Gato. And I'm Mary Bella Vida. And we're here in Hollywood, Florida. Today we're going to be touring a six bedroom, five bathroom home sitting on a nearly 7,000 square foot lot. And we want to give a special thanks to KFD for welcoming us back and letting us tour this amazing property. If you're interested in booking this as an Airbnb, also listed on VRBO, you can visit the description box below. We'll have all of that information there for you. Let's get started. the front entrance of the house we are actually sitting on a corner lot this is a remodeled property so I'm really excited to show you guys we've got a vast front yard it's very nicely manicured and you've even got some palm trees here so that's really nice now you do have a concrete driveway with some brick accents and then you've got these steps here that lead you to the front porch You've got these amazing reflective windows and these black wall sconces that add like a really nice accent to the house. And now I'm gonna show you inside. Welcome inside. So the first thing you're gonna see as soon as you walk in the front door is this amazing dining room to my left. This table is absolutely awesome. You can see 12 people here with this perfectly square table. And this room has so much natural lighting. I just, I think it's absolutely great. This house has a lot of natural lighting. As we go up a little bit more, you'll see the wood paneling on this slightly vaulted ceiling. I think that's also a really, really great feature. And you cannot miss this amazing cast iron chandelier. I think that's just absolutely gorgeous and just really, really brightens this room and really welcomes you in when you come in this home. You'll also see gorgeous flooring throughout the whole first floor. And as you keep moving in to the house, you have the amazing living room behind me. And I think it's really great that a lot of this has like thick, sturdy walls, and then you'll just be welcomed into another amazing seating area, the, the living room behind me, with another beautiful chandelier. The light fixtures in this house are just spectacular. I really, really like them. So as you start to look into the living room, you're greeted to Lots of seating space. There's actually no TV in this particular room. It's more of like a an actual living room versus like a family room. So we'll get to more of the you know fun areas of the house a little bit later. But you'll also notice a really really nice area rug to kind of make this feel really warm. Um, a bit more of the modern touch as well. Great coffee table. I like a lot of the little decorations in here. Some art pieces on the wall. It just recessed lighting in here. I also really really like just how well lit this entire house is. Besides all of the natural lighting that you have from all of the windows, there really is just so much beautiful lighting. So now Desi's gonna take us to this awesome kitchen. Welcome to the kitchen. This kitchen is beautifully lit with recessed lights. So if you look up, you'll see that. And look at this amazing island. I love this light fixture. You've got this built-in glass stove top. It's all stainless steel appliances. So you've got your oven, Moving over to this side, you've got your dishwasher. I love that all the cabinets are like wood panel and they're soft closed. So if you check it out, you can open it and just push it closed and it will close silently. Now this kitchen is fully equipped. Like we mentioned earlier, this is an Airbnb. You've got your pots, your pans, you've even got seasoning in this location. So that's really awesome. You've got plates, silverware and anything else you might need. I love this gooseneck faucet and it's also got this extra one right here. So that's very cool. You do have a window. Everyone loves a good kitchen window. You've got nice lighting coming in and this house does have a like waterfront view so you can actually see it while you're standing right here doing dishes. Look at this honeycomb backsplash. This is by far one of the most unique backsplashes I've seen in any kitchen. So very, very pretty. 
Moving on, you've got plenty of cabinetry, lots of space. Look at this massive fridge. It fits God knows how much in there. I mean, that's, that's a very, very large refrigerator. And if you continue to move over to this part of the kitchen, you have even more cabinetry and you've got a, a door that leads outside. We've got a couple of those and we're gonna show you those in just a second. I actually almost missed this. Look at this awesome bar stool seating area. This counter kind of hangs over and allows for bar stool seats to be put right under. So that's really awesome. And now we're gonna show you the first bedroom. So as we go into this hallway here, you'll notice on my right, this refrigerator. Now it does seem a little bit out of place, but what I think is really genius about it is because there are so many bedrooms in this house with so much sleeping space, they decided to have an extra fridge here for a lot of the common areas to be able to access for a lot of the people that they're gonna be housing in this house. So as we come into this hallway again, on my right here is a linen closet. On my left is a beautiful bathroom with marble tile on the walls and really, really nice tile on the floor and really, really pretty fixtures with a gold faucet there and a really pretty sink. I think it's absolutely stunning. That bathroom is just, just absolutely gorgeous. So when you come into this bedroom here, this actually was a renovated room. I believe this actually was a den because of how close it is to the outside, you actually have some a sliding glass door here, lots of natural lighting, so you can go right outside there. It's just absolutely gorgeous. So there is a wow factor in this room. I have to just, I'm so excited to show you. Something I've never seen, this has a real fireplace right in the bedroom. So that is just, I think it's just a phenomenal thing. It's so exciting. I and mean, can you imagine just staying here in this kind of off to the side by yourself, kind of secluded, and just you have your own fireplace. I think that's just great, especially for some of the rare cooler times that we have in this South Florida. <laughs> I think it would just be really, really nice for this particular home and just a really great selling feature. Flat screen TV on the wall, queen size bed, really modern, really, really clean. Now we're gonna take you to some of those other bedroom wings. So I'm about to show you one of the bedroom wings of the house. Before I do, I wanted to point out this gorgeous stairwell. We're gonna show you upstairs in just a second. Going into the hallway, you've got this storage closet. And if you see, you can also look at the beautiful art that's on the wall. It's got a whole bunch of different colors. I love this little hidden Mickey here. If you know me, you know I love Disney, so always gotta point that out. And now I'm gonna show you the second bedroom. So here we have a standard queen size bed. You've got a nightstand with a lamp. I love the windows above the bed to really light up the room, even though it doesn't really need it because it does have recessed lighting all on the roof. You've got this awesome full body mirror and it's even highlighted by some more recessed lighting up here. Now this room does have a dresser, a full size TV, and it's got an ensuite bathroom. Now this ensuite bathroom is also remodeled. It's got gorgeous gray tile throughout and it's got this pattern tile on the floor as well as inside the shower area. I love the black accented fixtures. Um, you've got a shower head and you also have a handheld. And now we're gonna show you some of the other bedrooms. right here on my left you'll also notice it has two beds in here two canopy beds so I think this is really really great for kids I know I actually had a canopy bed growing up and so what you can do is you can string you know some little really really nice sheer maybe like blankets or something over it and make it really really fun for the kids I think it's great that it also has a really nice feature wall over here so you have some three white walls and a really great feature wall here to kind of give the room a little bit more dynamic to it and you'll also notice the room is temperature controlled on its own with its own AC unit right there because these bedrooms in this wing actually used to be the garage. So what they were able to do was not connect it to the central AC of the regular home, but make them have their own AC unit. So I think it's really, really great. And of course, flat screen TV right here. Just enjoy whatever you want. This is a great room for the kids. 
So as you come into this hallway, it's a really wide hallway. You'll also notice before I go into this other room, it actually has a full size washer and dryer here, stackable. So you're really great, just has it right here on this floor. Then as you come into this other room here, another great room for kids with a bunk bed, with a slide that comes down from the very side right over here. Absolutely just great. I think this clock right here is also really, really unique, almost like a bit of a rustic farmhouse feel to it. So kind of a fun modern, but farmhouse feel to it as well. Great dresser, full size TV as well with another closet. I think this wing of the house is really, really good for kids. So now we're gonna take you upstairs. this amazing spiral staircase. You can see it has black accents that really match the theme of the home. You've got this amazing chandelier. I love that hanging light fixture. And Mary, why don't you show us what we've got up here? Absolutely, Desi. I mean, when you first come up the stairs, you are just amazed with the views of this lake right here. Just, I think this is just absolutely gorgeous. Just, oh my gosh, I'm like taken aback, you know, from how just, this is so open and you just get a perfect view as you go to either of the bedrooms. So we're actually gonna start on the room on this side. As soon as you walk in, you've got your mini closet on this side and then you're welcomed by two queen size beds. You have a dresser, you have a TV. I love that this room has windows on every single wall. You've got plenty of natural lighting coming in. You've got your ceiling fan and you also have an ensuite bathroom. So as you can see, this has a gorgeous white tile around. You've got a pattern tile on the floor that actually goes onto this step right before going into the shower. You do have a rain head, shower head, as well as a handheld. So that is a very common theme throughout all the bathrooms. You've got your vanity, again with the black accents. This one in this case has a silver uh, handle. You've got your stained glass window, standard toilet, and now we're gonna show you the master bedroom. All right, so now we're gonna welcome you into the master bedroom here. On my left, you have a nice porthole window right here. I think that's really, really cute. It's actually pretty unique. And as you come in, you get this grandiose view of your room. I have to point out though, this window right here, you get a perfect view of the Intracoastal Bay area. Just absolutely phenomenal. Just from the top of this house, this room has the best views of all the bedrooms in the home for sure. And then you have a nice flat screen TV, lots of closet space. You have closet right here, there, and another one right here. You have your king size bed on my right. Another window, <laughs> because there are so many windows in this room. And then you come into a really gorgeous master bathroom. All right, so as you see in this master bathroom, the first thing you're going to notice, I don't know if you guys haven't caught it yet, but this tile right here is a herringbone tile. It just gives this room such a different dynamic than you would normally see in the rest of the home. The rest of the home has a lot of white walls, really, really bright. So this room is very, very different. And I think it's just a really, really great touch as well as the floor. It has a different type of pattern on the tile on the floor. So I think it's a really great contrast and really, really smart for them to design this particular bathroom this way. And so behind me on my right, I have the stand up shower with a nice glass enclosure and beautiful brass fixtures with the rain head shower and the nozzles over here then you have right here you have your dual vanity with your dual sinks right here with the fabricated sinks in the actual countertop a giant oversized mirror so you and your significant other can have lots of space to be able to see yourself first thing in the morning more brass fixtures right there the drawers here I think are just really great for a bathroom so you can have you know kind of store all of your toiletries since it doesn't have a linen closet it has tons of cabinet space here and as you go a little bit farther down you have your toilet seat and the first thing that we have not seen on this channel yet is a bidet so i think that's a really really great feature especially to have in a master bathroom and now we're going to show you the game room 
Welcome to the game room. So this is actually a sunken room. You've got plenty of entertainment. You've got this foosball table right here. To my left, you've got a billiards table. And behind me, you can see that there's actually like a lounge area. You've got an L-shaped couch. You've got two additional seats, and then you've got a beautiful marble coffee table. You've got a flat screen TV. So like I mentioned before, plenty of entertainment. Absolutely, I think this room just has so much to offer. This feature wall on my right is just so, so different. The pattern design on it is just really, really different. Also above, on two different sides of the wall, you'll notice this glass block for a window. So I think that's another, kind of like an old school feature to give it a little bit more of a, you know, really chill and relaxed vibe. Up above, you actually, have, you'll see the wood, kind of like a wood ceiling with the wood beams. I think that also just gives it another really relaxed vibe as well. And then you have some really great big windows here that allow a lot of natural light in that will actually show you the patio area that we're gonna go see next. Now this is just a gorgeous backyard. You've got a massive heated pool, so that's really convenient. You've also got plenty of seating area. You've got lounge chairs, you've got an L-shaped couch. It just makes for a lot of space. You also have a basket full of pool towels, so if you were going to book this as your Airbnb, you know that you have separate pool towels. And you've also got a, a fence that's like a net fence to protect your kids from falling in, so that's really great. Absolutely, and you can actually see that in the floor of this really, really pretty white stone. I think it's just absolutely gorgeous for this backyard area. Because you actually have a little bit of the privacy from some of the trees in this actual, on this property, I think that because the white stone, it actually reflects the sunlight really well, so it still makes this backyard area really, really nicely lit for some reason. It's really, really great. Also, that pool is heated. Not that we have to use it too much in Florida, but in some of the cooler months, it's really, really great. I think the privacy fence is also really nice as well. And that's a wrap for today's tour, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Quick shout out to KFE Homes for letting us tour this gorgeous property. If you do want to book it for your short-term rental, it is available on Airbnb and VRBO, and the link will be in the description box. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. We hope you guys are enjoying a lot of our tours. All the love and support on the channel really does mean the world to us. So please don't forget to like, give us a thumbs up on this video so we can have our channel be seen by so many other people. It really does mean the world to us. Hit the notification bell as well so you don't miss out on any of our new and upcoming tours. And don't forget to subscribe, guys, and we'll see you on the next one.